It has never been more important to have CRNAs in Washington, D.C. advocating for our profession than right now. The goal here is to increase visibility of CRNAs as thought leaders. If you're not a consistent face on the Hill, people forget you. The level and caliber of people that attend this conference, I mean, this is, you know, some of the most well-prepared students and CRNAs that you can come across. Are you excited to be a CRNA? I am, and being here makes me even more excited about it. <laughs> I've never been prouder to be part of this profession than I have this week. It's so wonderful and empowering to be around all of these experienced CRNAs who have paved the way. It's been very informative and learned a lot about the issues that are going on right now at the federal level. I feel like that's really when you get to hear the voice of the organization. Knowing where you would like to see anesthesia in five or ten years and being active in that process, I think it's so important. I feel like I know what I need to do to make a difference on Capitol Hill. Thank you very much and have a great visit in Washington. Happy lobbying, everybody. I'm actually excited to go put boots on the ground and actually put it, everything we've been talking about into action. We need to promote our own profession. Somebody else can't promote it for us. We have to tell our own message. The message I'm receiving from our membership is loud and clear. You want change. We aren't just fighting for our profession. We are fighting for our patients. You have an important message to give. You all are ready to give it. So let's go do this. Come on. The value we bring to the system, wow. We're going to win that debate all day, every day.